My heart rate slowly increased as I took the turn off to where I wanted to go for a walk. I had already gotten partly dressed at home, and I would do the last things in the car to finish it off there. Several cars were parked, but luckily it was otherwise quiet. I finished my look and closely watched the surroundings via the mirrors. Nothing was coming, and I stepped outside after a final check in the mirror. It felt great. I adjusted the camera a bit and suddenly heard a car approaching. I was shocked but immediately thought of my wife's words when she saw my outfits. You look so natural, and if you don't know, you have no idea it's you. Suddenly, however, I saw a couple coming out of the forest. They didn't seem to see me, but suddenly a cyclist passed by, and now everyone seemed to be looking at me. For a second, I froze. Luckily, I realized I had to keep acting and moving as usual. This video is sponsored by DeJacket Maker. I have had little time for Kirsten in the past few weeks, and I want to get away from it all again. Doing this as Kirsten seemed like the best combination. At the end of the summer, I found flat boots in equestrian style. I always wanted to try out a look like that. Shortly afterward, the jacket maker approached me to see if I wanted to try another leather item from them. The idea for this video immediately came to me, and it would be fun to try a short bomber jacket since these are on trend this season. The leather of this jacket is wonderfully soft and the quality is excellent, just like the jacket from last time. It is certainly not cheap, but that is never the case if you buy good quality leather. See the attachment for the link to my jacket and use the coupon code KIRSTEN10 for an extra discount. If you want to know more about my outfit and videos like this one on Friday before they go online, check the link to my newsletter. The couple strolled on and I decided to do the same. I crossed the road into a meadow. What a wonderful feeling in the open air. However, due to all the commotion, I started feeling warm, causing my glasses to fog up. Still, I wanted to stay outside, so I exchanged my flat boots for my stiletto heel boots. On the paved surface of the parking lot, these boots walked as I am used to, but as soon as I walked back up the forest path to the meadow, I felt my pointy heels sink into the ground. Walking could be more practical, but it's nice to feel somehow. At least I now understand why few women don't wear high heels in the forest. I walked around for a while and decided to go back to the car. Once inside, I discovered that my heel was full of perforated leaves. A big smile appeared on my face, and at the same time, I realized that I had missed my wife while walking. In the evening, we talked about my adventures. I told her I now felt so much confidence from her being outside that I suddenly missed her while walking. She was happy to hear I felt so confident and said she might go with me someday. What a wonderful afternoon. I definitely want to do it more often in the coming period. I already have an idea for my next outfit, but I'm also very curious about what you think would be a nice outfit. Feel free to leave your suggestions in the comments, and who knows, I might be able to use them next time. See you soon.